Gianna. And I'm Kaylee. And this is One Direction Weekly Update. Mm -hmm. So basically what we're going to start doing is making videos every week if we can um, about One Direction. We're going to take a few minutes to talk about the rumors that are going on and our thoughts and opinions and your thoughts and opinions. And then we'll take a few minutes to answer any questions, whether it's personal or about One Direction or anything else you guys want to ask us. Um, but now that school's starting for us, it's going to be harder to um, upload videos every week, but we will definitely try our best depending on how many subscribers we get. Uh -huh. um, and so subscribe. Subscribe to our videos. Like our videos. And, um, yeah. Thank you. So Kaylee and I wanted to share um, about the day that we met One Direction and saw them in concert. So um, <sighs> our local mall was having a book signing. For the Dare to Dream book that they came up at with. At Barnes & Noble and everyone was able to camp out. Um, the night before they were giving out wristbands, it was 500 wristbands on a first come first serve basis. And the first 500 people to line up and get stamped got wristbands to meet the boys. Um, and so it was crazy, and there were so many people that were trying to get tickets and trying to get wristbands, and we were lucky enough to be the last yeah. 500 yeah. Um, to, to get those wristbands. Um, and so we camped out overnight for 12 hours at our local crazy mall. Crazy night. On a school <laughs> night. And and um, at like midnight, no one was able to sleep because we were so excited and so pumped up that we got these wristbands. We, um, since it was in the mall, the only thing that was open was Champs. And we were really hungry and we couldn't afford anything more. <laughs> we couldn't afford anything but appetizers. So it was me, and water. Kaylee, <laughs> and two of my best friends from school. And we camped out and... We went to Champs in the middle of the night, and we got appetizers. The people looked at us like we had four heads. They had no idea what I we were I think the waitress didn't really enjoy it. And our <laughs> security guard that was by us was the coolest guy ever. He was so fun. Yeah. Um, we only, like, no one got sleep. Like, I only got, like, two hours of sleep personally. Yeah. And next day was school. Thank God we didn't. We didn't go. <laughs> we had to convince our parents too. they wouldn't like it if we didn't go. Thank God they, did. yeah, thank God they didn't let school. us go to school and the next morning at six o'clock in the morning oh they gosh, distributed the wristbands to the 500 girls and oh we were speechless like i the reactions on all these those girls faces was everyone was screaming it nobody was amazing can handle it. and then the day of the signing oh was my oh my god um people didn't know if all the 500 girls who got their wristbands were able to meet the boys because they had a concert that night so they had to go back to the venue get ready make wait yeah sound check again because they did earlier so they had a time limit and they had a lunch break in between that so they had to fit that in also so it was really hard because we didn't know if we actually had a chance even though we did have the wristbands we didn't know if we were a hundred percent sure about getting to meet them and getting our book signed, mm -hmm. but um, we woke up at like 5 in the morning, we packed our stuff up, and we left, and we tried to get like the first in line, um, so we knew we had a good chance of meeting them, and literally the table was like right here where they were signing, and we were standing like right here, and so we had really, really good spots in line. Mm -hmm. um, and so it was eight hours of standing in, like, 95-degree weather. Yeah. They had DJs to kind of, like, pump us up and everything. It was really fun. And, and then finally when the boys arrived, I mean, like, my ho whole world stopped. Like, everything. In it's like you wouldn't know until you meet them because I was thinking, oh, my gosh, they're really here. It's not a magazine. And I was flipping out, and everyone else was, but I was really crazy. It was insane. And we got our book signed. We went up to the guy. I gave Harry, Louie, and Niall high fives. And um, it was the best experience in the world. And I gave Niall a green Irish Blackhawk snapback, and he really loved it. And I was extremely excited about that. 
And I, on Twitter, I followed him, and he DM'd me and said he did wear it. So I'm really, really happy that he did, and I'm really happy that he really liked it. We all took pictures with the hat, so like... So we can say a we wore it. of Nile wearing a green snapback with the Blackhawk symbol on it. You know that's Kaylee. Pretty intense. Um, and then the night of the concert was just insane. Oh um, people didn't know of Ali Murs. I mean, he was their opening act. He was nobody really knew amazing. Knew about him. But after that, I have to say, pretty much everyone who was at that concert in that arena has got to be the biggest Ali Murs fan. I think, I mean, like, he's an awesome performer. You support One Direction, you have to support Ali Murs. Yeah. And if you don't know who he is, you have to go watch his videos and listen to his. But we just wanted to share our experience of One Direction. If you guys have any experiences with meeting One Direction, going to concerts, anything, you can comment below, subscribe to our video, and we will make sure that we post videos every Friday to keep you updated on One Direction and the boys and everything that's going on. And, and remember to subscribe to our video and comment any questions that you have for us so we will try to answer them in our next video. And if we do have time between school and other things and activities that we have, we can maybe update more videos, not on Friday, maybe during the week if we have time. So because now that we're starting high school, we don't know how much homework homework we're going to have and how much time yeah. we're going to have to do these videos. But we'll try our hardest. Bye. Bye.